Good morning. We are looking toward downtown Fargo on our first alert Skycam network. And you can see we've got that glow on the horizon with clear skies and that sunshine getting ready to rise for us here for today. So a nice, quiet, calm, and pretty start to your Wednesday morning. And we've got a fantastic day ahead of us here today. Here's a look at our temperatures right now. We have some 50s around the valley, 55 in Fargo, 50 in Grand Forks, a bunch of 55s in the Southern Valley, low 50s up to the north. And uh, looking at some conditions that are pretty quiet as far as the wind is concerned. We've had a lot of places reporting just calm air, just quiet weather. And that does sometimes lead to some fog, and there are places where visibility is down quite a bit. Hallock, some dense fog there at a half mile visibility. And over in Park Rapids, too, we're struggling a bit at less than a mile visibility there as well. So there are some places dealing with the fog this morning in those spots. Even after the sun is up in a little over a half hour, you're going to want to have those headlights on so people can see you. Here's a look at your radar. We've got some quiet conditions. We had those showers pass overhead in Fargo last night in the over night hours late last night. Uh, those have moved on and kind of fallen apart too. And now we're looking at some quieter weather here to start off your morning for this Wednesday. It just looks like a great day. So let's take a look at that hourly planner. A nice midweek break from precipitation, though not a lot of us have seen much here already this week. As we head into the later morning, temperatures on the rise into the 60s and continuing on into the noon hour, we'll already be in the 70s. So warming things up too compared to how we've started the week. Heading into the afternoon, here's a look at our highs. We're going to see some 70s to some low 80s, warmer west, not as toasty in the east, but still getting into the 70s. Will be nice after some of us spent the day in the 60s the last couple of days. And then heading into this evening, still looking pretty quiet, some clouds out to the west, but overall looking really good for your Wednesday. Great wet day to be outdoors and doing some work outside. Just make sure you get that sunblock on because it's going to be sunny all day long. Here's a look at the 11 o'clock hour tonight. Watching those rain and thunder showers move in overnight. These will not be strong, but still uh, you may wake up to some rain tomorrow morning. And in addition to that, they'll kind of hang around a little bit into tomorrow. Too. So where that's happening, uh, you may have that impact your morning drive. This is nine o'clock. We're looking at that it's still ongoing, but that's not really the main event. We're going to get that cleared out of here. It's heading into the afternoon and evening that we've got a line of showers and thunder showers developing. Some of them could end up being strong, especially in southeastern North Dakota, where we have the potential for some severe weather. And this will continue into Thursday evening. So here's a look at that storm risk. Anywhere in the valley, we're looking at some type of risk in the darker green, a mark Marginal risk. It's low end, but still the potential's there. And then in that southern part of the valley, we're looking at a slight risk for some severe storms Thursday and again into early Friday. Once that clears out, we're looking at a warm weekend ahead, temperatures into the mid to some upper 80s. So feeling more like summertime coming up. Thank you, Lisa. I'm